Hello, welcome to Not So Lonely Nights. I'm your host, Aridon, and tonight we are back on Manicamia, Alchemists of Al Rivas. I forgot to turn my light on. There we go, now you can see my beautiful, beautiful face. Hi, Bab. She just came to wave at me and ran off. Turn that sound down just a little bit. Stream start pennies! Oh, yeah! Thank you, thank you, Dustin. Alright. <laughs> Alright, let's see. Where did I leave off? Student Affairs and get an assignment. Pop around the corner real quick and see... Was there anything I could craft over here? Community challenge is 50% complete. I don't think we're gonna hit it. Hmm. I wanna know what that light bulb means. So if I craft a new uniform, then I get, can get different stats on it, but I only have attack plus, so not really worth it. Alright. So we'll just go and do our, where did I say we were going, campus? Grant Student Affairs. Hello! What can I help you with? These are the courses you can currently accept. Would you like to take this course? Predictology? Learn how to utilize a tool for response times. Details in class. Okay. Please, head to your classroom on time. Alrighty, let's learn predictology. In this course, I will teach you predictology. This is the study of predicting progress and results to make decisions. It may not quite feel like a science, but there's no harm in learning it. What does that mean? Why are you asking me? For example, let's say you encounter a huge monster during your searches. What would you do in this situation, Mr. Gossiping Vain Aurelius? Yes, uh, run away? <laughs> Running away is certainly an option, but check your situation first. Do you know your enemy? Will you lose against it? How is your group doing? How quick is it? Can you even run away? How far do you have to run? You must know your limits as well as your situation, and then you can decide. That was such a leading question to make a fool of him. It is hard. In order to predict correctly, experience is important. That's why we emphasize hands-on assignments to build this experience. But don't just do it. Try to predict the most effective way, understand? Yes, Missy Solday. For today's assignment, I've prepared a simple task to predict. You have obtained a fishing pole. 
You must go to the heights and fish there for two hours. But try not to catch any monsters. That's it. Respond accurately and catch your fish. Fish for... Fish more for higher grade. Minus points for catching monsters. Two hours. Huh. Fishing, huh? I like eating fish, but catching them is a different story. I'm just not patient enough to wait. Hmm, I know somebody like that. Me neither. I'll end up daydreaming, and before you know it, I'll fall asleep. Used to fish a little before I came to school. Then we leave it to you. Good luck! Do my best. You can now go to the heights. Oh, I just found a tuft, that thing I had to go through the whole old schoolhouse to find before. say that had better have killed that one. Cooney Press. Cooney are, are, are pretty uh, puny. Yay! Huh, we're done. map button again? There it is. Okay. It's pretty bad. I've been playing Bravely Default 2 for the last couple days, so I'm getting the some of the buttons mixed up. Oh, no. Oh, this is bad. Uh, do I have a uh, panther raid? Oh, it hits in a row! So if I target the mid, the back row, I can hit just the Morning Glory here, it'll hit both brownies. The Leopard, but if I target here, it will hit all three there. Here we go! Beat him up! Wow, that was awesome. Wow, getting wrecked. Pretty hard. I have no stats for any of these, so... Jeez, Vane, where is, when do you get a turn? Sulfur, please! Ah, Vane. Unhappy bab. Okay, so the leopard's weak to ice. Here you go. Wow, that was a lot of damage.
Wait, this will hit both of them? Sulfur, please! Oh, that was cool. And it analyzed both of them. Oh, that was awesome. I didn't know that that attack could hit multiple targets. Huh. She was off by like three damage. Six damage. So it'll get a turn and then we can finish off. Jeez. Huh, we're done. That fight was rough. Obtained a doll. I can now synthesize a straw doll. And I found Lando. What is... Oh, it... It's a red fruit. Okay. How many potions do I have? Just one. I did not plan ahead. Just like with so many RPGs, the early levels are just, they suck so bad. You know, I don't really want to do a panther. Nope, not worth it. If I can't kill all three... I guess we'll just go ahead and do the healing echoes. Heal the wounds. Just so we can get... People healed up and ready. Hyper, donating. Thank you. <laughs> yes, you are here indeed. the heel. And then she can finish it. I win! Peace! There's a lot of items here, though. Blue petals, burdock, straight. Wood chips. Spring decor. I can now make eternal turnkeys. I think this will give us leeway. Yep. 
still not dead. Wow. Well, at least broken. Uh, analyze. Sulfur, please. Cool. It died. And then bonk. Sulfur, please. Rip. Ha! Huh, we're done. I killed the little uh, Gurgi. Whoa, that thing is fast. Got first strike. Let's do it. I can only hit the cobalt or the harpy, but destroyed both cobalts, so that's good. Hopefully I can basically just stun lock the harpy now. Heal the wounds. Cause I'm almost out of heals and everything else. break in the road, so I want to go down. Yep, this is the area. Oh, found the fishing spot. This is where I have to fish, right? Yep, she said try not to catch monsters. Leave the rest to you. Assignment start. Uh, yeah, teach me how to fish. After touching the fish icon, a bar will show up at the bottom right. Press the X button when the pointer is in the orange to reel it in. But beware, sometimes you may catch monsters. If you can't keep up with the pointer's speed, spin left analog stick to slow down the speed of the pointer. Caught a joker fish. Failed. Okay. Whoa, that was really bad. Another joker fish. Sasuga joker. Yeah. It's funny because uh, the Japanese for fish is sakana, so sakana joker. Oh, another joker fish. More joker fish. It's about time? I think so. What's wrong? But he's thinking these two didn't do anything this time. What, really? No, I didn't think that at all. Just kidding, let's get going. Eat, that's exactly what he was thinking. And I have the uh, wings of Icarus back to school. I exploded. Was I supposed to bring the fish to the teacher or to student affairs? 
Did they specify? I'm not a very good student. Excuse me, we're here to turn in the assignment for predictology. Yes, I've been informed. Show me your handbooks and I will stamp your grades. I got a B. Because I missed a few, I guess. I didn't catch a monster, though. I'll take a B. Just have to make sure I get at least one more B. Hey! Hmm? Aren't they, you know, the ones in Flay's workshop? Yeah, that's them. I heard they, they're even worse than Flay. Really? We have to be careful then. <laughs> well, it sounds like we have some sort of rumor going around. Yeah, it doesn't sound like a good one, though. <sighs> it's so rude, whispering in secret behind a person's back. So wooed. So wooed. Night, night, Helen. Yeah. Good night. You want to say good night? Night, night. Night, night. No. <laughs> okay. You've had a very busy day. Yep, there was Bab, and she is now gone. She's had a long day. And when she went to the park, and we went out to eat. Oh gosh, who's this kid? Koropok? Nice to meet you. My name is Koropok. Just a rumor spreading gossip lover. Rumor spreading? That's some hobby you've got. You miss her already. Then the rumors about us were spread by. <laughs> Sorry about that. It was just too good of a rumor to pass up. Pass up? Hurry up and take it back. Yeah, I'm so embarrassed. I don't think I can walk around campus anymore. Well, now, 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 there. Rumors aren't all bad, you know. It means that people are interested in you and your reputation. Depending on the rumor, you could get discounts or teachers will like you. Really? I don't know if I can trust you on that one. It's true, it's amazing. Why don't if you don't believe me, want to try spreading a rumor right now? It'll cost you. Charge people? It takes money to spread rumors. The quickest way to spread them is to pay people off with a little cash. This guy sounds way too fishy. I forgot about this mechanic. I'm not saying you have to do it now, just come by if you're interested. And remember, even with my capabilities, I can't spread lies. You're gonna have to make the seed of the rumor yourselves. It's exactly what it sounds like. I can pay the- I- essentially it's like unlocking titles in other games. For various bonuses. So my current one is, we're getting attention just for joining the workshop. So, as I progress through the game, I'll get more... More rumors will unlock, and then I can get all sorts of different bonuses. Oh, that red meat is a dried pr red puny? Oh, you actually sell food. Delicious soup! I feel like I've gotta buy it. It's called Delicious Soup. And Powdering Powder. A book on how to make delicious soup. Oh, I can now make green soup. Book on how to make powder. Yes, there is also goat mill and a carrotato. What is a carrotato? A red thin potato. Only one can be harvested per plant. It's strong in taste and less cooked. Make goat ches? I don't know how. She looked angry when I left.
Gotta see if there's a new any new recipe I can buy here. I can now make Zettel, which is paper. And you still just sell, sell some elemental stones. Which, you know what? I have those, but I don't have any glacier stones. So I'm gonna buy one of those. Just to see if I can make what I can do with that. Um, workshop. I needed the workshop hallway. I do hate that these two rooms are separate. Alright, so if I try making it with ice? No? Okay. Just trying to see if I can make any, like, alternate weapons. Nope. The Straw Doll. Necro Cloth. Burdock Straight. Or a Worn Weapon. Well, I have more Worn Weapons. A Tuft. And I have to use one of Vane's lightning collars. That's interesting. Alright, we'll do it. Because I have the extra one. You basically never actually want to sell anything. Because everything can wind up being synthesized. Magic up. Alright, well, it will teach you how to use lightning. And it will give... This is probably going to wind up on Jess because it gives a magic increase. So let's give it defense and health because she is so squishy. I need to make more necro cloth if I want to make more armors. Which I remember the one ingredient I couldn't find before were tufts, but I just found a crap load of them. So, yep, I can make necro cloths and zetto. Okay, we'll put in a mushroom, a tuft, and a water. Nikki's over there taking a nap. Okay. Giant potion. Alright. Necro cloth that now gives defense and health increases. And paper. It's more important to synthesize it at least once. Well. You need to synthesize everything at least once for your grow book, but also uh, so that they have synthesis abilities when you craft equipment, so you have more options to give spells and stats.
What am I missing for this? Polish powder. Or is it Polish powder? Uh, I've got everything for that. What do I need for green soup? Oh! I got a new recipe for trying Lando instead of spinach or water. I need salt and a carrotato. And flame. Uh, I don't really want to use a necro cloth here. I think I want to make arm uh actually make an armor instead. Running back and forth, back and forth. Yeah, I probably need the uni to make a new, uh, the alternate crack hammer. Alright, well I can make a male or female uniform, and since I have more female party members right now, I suppose I will do that. the power of healing so I can give them all girls healing or a dark spell called half. Which right now everybody having healing is more important. Uh, more mana? More defense? Um... I don't actually remember if this one has a Japanese audio option. I'm Vain. Bokua Bain. Yeah. Bain Aude Olusta. Bokua Bain. Bain Aude Olusta. I'm Vain. Vain. Yep. And it's one of the rare instances where you could change the audio mid-game. You don't have to, like, go back to the title screen and reboot everything like you do in so many others. Oh, crap. I just crafted a bunch of stuff. Uh, grow books. I need to make flower and a male uniform for Vane. Thump hammer and a flame for Nick. Wait, for Jess. Wait, I thought Jess needed me to make a to make the girl uniform. Huh. Okay. Don't know what Nikki needs there, but. Get a speed up for her. Wait, and I need to make a thump hammer for Jess. That doesn't make sense. Unless I guess a thump hammer is a different item. Uh, I'm gonna go... Gather... I think I just found unis in the living forest. So we'll go grab... I want to find at least one uni and see if that's when I need to make a new... Um, um, thing of a bobber. Make a new hammer. And 
you know, in the meantime, I can also get some koalas. That doesn't hurt. say that uh, I, I know I'm slightly disappointed. One, one of my slight disappointments with this game is that all the different weapons that you craft huh, actually do not change the character sprites in combat. Um, so the weapons you see them with now are always the ones you're going to see them with in combat. These enemies are. Uh... I'm gonna go all out. These enemies are all pretty easy to kill. One, so. Two, three, and you're fine. Ha! We're done. Found an Uni yet, have I? I don't think I have. Was it on this map? Yep. As soon as I say it, I find one. I think this will give us leeway. there's anything else I really need to find here. Since I found the, like, one thing that I wanted. It is funny, though, that there... There was conversation about how you have, like, time limits each day. But going to gather on these paths does not consume any of your, your weak time. I, I mentioned that last time. But I find it kind of hilarious. Simply because I should be going to my class, but instead I'm three hours out in the field gathering plants. I think this will give us leeway. Which is what everybody should do. Huh, Just go that? beat up koalas. They're gross. I think this will give us leeway. Found some money. So if I collected enough money, because because it's called coal, would would I become King Coal, Old King Coal? This'll give us leeway. I'd be Nat King Cole. I don't know if that's good or not. I win!
just running all over collecting all this loot. I think this will give us leeway. Do you think this will give us leeway? Jassing. Okay, that's who I was thinking of. I don't know why I said old, but that is who I was thinking of. I obtained a wooden club weapon. It can be equipped by... Uh, Nikki. Old King Cole was the Banjo Tui boss. Okay, okay. Although I've never actually played Banjo Tui. In fairness, I don't Looks even think so I ever strong. finished Banjo Kazooie, so. Fire weak, fire weak. They're all fire weak, and she doesn't have fire. Okay. For now, just bunk. take out as many of the weaklings as I can. How did that first one miss? I'm not complaining because, you know, I missed, but it clearly, like, grabbed me and slammed me into the ground, so how was that a miss? low enough that Heartcracker can actually kill him now. Yeah! Got some bear spirit. Bear hugs. Like, don't be late for class. I'm like, sorry, I'm six hours out in the wild bone grove ahead no freshman beyond this point we're not supposed to go there till we're sophomores you know what since i'm about to go back anyway what's one more fight looks so strong yep the bone zone Here you go. 
Jeez, that does so much damage. I mean, I know it's a beatdown and all, but still. Alright, and now Jess finishes him off with a heart crack. More bear hugs! I win! Peace! Alright, um, and I will be right back just a quick second. Sorry, uh, caffeine doing its thing. Alright, we're back. 
Um, workshop hallway was where I was going. I needed to check to see if the uni was what I needed to make the new weapon. <sighs> so I know I was out there, like, collecting some bears and koalas, but it's funny because in Bravely Default 2, I got the Beastmaster who does the exact same thing. Okay, it was the uni that I needed. And then I need black steel. To make a male uniform, I just needed to make one more necro cloth. Unfortunately, I think I can mass produce it now. I I cannot because I have to make it with a different material. Okay. Oh, she makes it wind. I thought it was water for Jess. So yeah, I can mass produce stuff with materials I already have, which is nice. So now it's not so bad if I need to Okay, my sound did desync. One quick second. Okay, there we go. All right. So first one's fire. And I hit water. That's fine. Earth. Necro cloth is wind. I hope it turns out well. I made a flame. Good, it's done. Yay, a bomb! A bomb! So, you like bombs? Yep, it's so alchemic when things go boom or bang! Is that so? Oh, by the way, I read this in a book a few days ago. Read what? A combustive explosion requires more than a few thousand degrees of heat, but you only need negative 195 degrees Celsius, the same as liquid nitrogen, for a cold one. It can stop almost all organisms from their normal bodily functions. Th that's a pretty weird fun fact. I know so many people who would who would do... They'd be like, hey, fun fact! Uh, if you wanted to murder somebody, all you need to do is this. Doesn't it sound fun to make a bomb like that? I don't think it'll be fun, especially if I give it to you. Don't worry, I won't use it on you. Alrighty then, I'll try it out later. Be really careful when you're handling it. I can now make ice bombs. So I need to make that, and I can make a thunder bomb. Guess I'm gonna need one more necro powder. Or necro cloth. Oh, no, I don't. This one doesn't use cloth at all. 
bleach plus ammonia is mustard gas. Yeah, see, that's what I'm talking about. I know way too many people who would just throw out all sorts of facts and you're just like, why do you know that? Should I be scared? Rod. All right, well, I just made a whole bunch of bombs. What does that unlock on any of these? Uh, well, I'm gonna go make the male uniform for Jess. We unlock. A thump hammer is the skill. Okay, we got the skill thump hammer for Jess. Um, and we can get more of those stats because we're definitely going to need those going forward. Nothing new for Nikki, though. List Koalaria. I don't know what I need for any of Nikki's upgrades, but for Vayne, I can just make his uniform. So we will go do that. But this is where, like, the majority of gameplay is. Go into field, collect materials, come back, see what you can make, and just repeat. Ooh, a medium defense upgrade. But if I do... But the paper will give me access to spells. I think I'd rather have spells right now. Yep. Yep. Save the worn armor, because I only have the one, so if I need it later for something... But, we'll take half... Uh, SP and attack. Plus. All right. I need the to make an eternal turnkey. And I need a tangerine. Two eternal turnkeys and a tangerine. How do I make that? One more check on the ingredients, and then we'll actually start progressing. I need... Flour, I just need... Oh, I can make flour with... Oh. What am I making? I was was going to be making flour, but instead we made polish powder. Okay, it's done. Thank you for helping, Nikki. Mm -hmm. Nikki, just a little taste. Ew. What? You're not supposed to... You can't lick that. It's not supposed to be edible yet. It just kind of looked like it'd be tasty. 
Besides, it's your fault. Make powder that's edible, at least. That's impossible. Sugar's good, but how's it hard to make? Uh, but it's hard to make. So how about salt? I'll teach you how. If you're only to teach me, I'll try to make it. Better make sure it tastes good. I can now make salt because she tried to eat polish powder. Okay. I have everything for that. What did I say? I need the carotato. Joker? That's what the Joker fish looks like, by the way. That's just weird. Now, I keep making these the highest I can. I think there are actually different uh, effects that can be unlocked by lowering the quality of these as well. But I'm not going to go through all of that. Hey, Vane. What's wrong? You seem kind of mad. You're boring. You only make white powder. I can't really help being boring, though. Let's make some black powder sometimes, too. Well, I mean, you can make it if you want to, I guess. I can? Of course, just don't use any dangerous materials. I know, I know. What should I use? Well, if it's black... Oh, yeah! Gunpowder! Might as well make it go BOOM real fast. I did a bad thing. I can now make black powder. What do I need for black powder? Carbon boulder. A bunch of other things that I don't have. Well, that turned into a lot of different things. Make one more polish powder. So I can make those two eternal turnkeys. Said I wasn't going to keep doing this, but everything keeps lining up now. Oop. Lightning and detail. A spring that will continue to move forever, though it is rather useless. Try making this one slightly better, see if I can get a better effect on it. See, it lost stun and gained lightning instead. And now with two, it gains detailed. And with three upgrades, it also gets SP+. Plus. Alright, so now I can make the upgraded male and female uniforms, but only one of each. Should have made another turnkey. Oh wait, I have to get a tangerine for the female one. Altered Uniform Male. Uniform for boys who want to stand out. Um, slightly delays enemy actions. Oh, that's cool. And... More SP or more attack? Just go with more attack. Looks good. Alright. Let's go buy that tangerine, come back. So much exciting gameplay here, guys. And I went to the wrong place. At least the load times aren't horrendous.
Alright. Oh! I got a new rumor. Uh, greedy needy. Gather more than 40 items in one search. Um... Fifteen percent more chance of monsters to drop items. All right, so that's our new rumor. So monsters drop more items now. Pretty good. Uh, workshop, and I meant to go to the hallway. I will say, because I've been playing Switch a lot the last few days, playing on a PS2 controller, I keep wanting to go to the D-pad, because that's just where my thumb wants to rest. And it's really messing up my running, so... And I've got a pink uniform. Healing. Mm. Magic and SP. hard to be like, the crack hammer's better in terms of having more, giving more health and also the flame gaze, but the wooden club is just stronger. Wait, what can I make for vein? Flower? I have the stuff for flower now? Gosh dang it. But doing all of the crafting as soon as I can means that I'll be stronger, so hopefully it means less coming back to do this just because... Did I need? Oh, the green soup. Earth, water, salt is water. Interesting. And earth. A to 100% gives HP and it's warm. boost. Uh, 
nobody else can. I think we're finally caught up on everything that I can do right now. I just spent like 30 minutes crafting. But you know, I guess people watch. People will hang out for uh, other streams of just chillin', crafting, with a little bit of murdering. Hello! What can I help you with? But now we can progress. These are the courses you can currently accept. Onward. Pharmacy 1. Would you like to take this course? Oh. Speaking of pharmacy, before I do that, I'm gonna go buy some healing potions. Luxury purse. How to make a bag out of slightly expensive materials. Wait, so I can make a new weapon for Jess? Once again, see what we can make. Because I didn't think to go to the infirmary before, and now we've found that she sell she sold me a weapon recipe. either need a brand name bag already made or a huffin. Whatever that is. I need pleather cloth to make the base weapon. So I make a fake brand name bag. No, I make a brand name bag and then I guess I can make a... What? Once I get to, uh, once I finish this class assignment, then I get free time. Hello. These are the. Would you like Learn to take this course? Learn methods of gathering course? ingredients. The assignment will require you to see an actual farm. Details will be explained in class. Okay, we get to go farming. Please head to your classroom on time. Whoa. Good morning, everyone. My name is Melanie, and I'll be teaching pharmacy for the next three years. Nice to meet you. In this class, you will learn more syntheses, especially for medicine. Today, I will teach you about plants. Aw, just plants. I want to learn about crazy potions and stuff. Now, now, plants are the most basic ingredient in most synthesis, especially in medicine. For example, the heal jar. The ingredients are clear water, blue petal, and can anyone tell me what else? Jessica? Oh, uh, me? Um, it's spinach herb. Correct. I see you've studied well. Yay! This heal jar is used to heal wounds, but the actual healing power comes from this spinach herb. The others just enhance the power. Now do you see the importance of plants? Yes. In pharmacy, you'll learn methods to enhance the powers of these plants. The effects of the medicine can be to heal or to strengthen you. Medicine is a necessity for your searches as well, so pay attention. Yes, ma'am. Well, now that you understand the importance of plants, 
I think I'll have you all take care of these plants today. In the living forest, there's a farm. I want you to go water the plants. You could bring water from campus or get some from the river nearby. That sounds easy enough. You think so? There's a lot of monsters nearby, so it's quite dangerous. Well, they'll get beaten up badly by Vane. Me? <laughs> How dependable. Oh, I know. While you're there, gather a few things for me with this shovel. Receive key item. Shovel. It's all for today's class. When you're done watering, go to student affairs. I'll be watching you secretly, so don't even think about ditching. Good luck, everyone. Give water to the farm. Grade required. And I was given two more heal jars. Nice. And I've got a green soup, too. The living forest, huh? Well, let's go for a little walk. Okay, let's go and get this done with. And I was just there beating up monsters. But I think I went to the le I went to the left, but I remember the farm, it's to the right. Yep. Because the bone zone is the dragon's grave. Oh look! Some of the enemies are actually now weak enough that I can just kill them without fighting. You still get items, but you don't get any SP from killing them that way. But that just shows you how much stronger I am. There's a farm up ahead? Yeah, the seniors told me, so I can't be wrong. Because the seniors would never lie. All of you guys, when you were seniors, or if you are seniors, or if you will be soon, you didn't or will not lie, right? up this way. Um, but I'm going the wrong way. Okay, now we're we're on the right path again. All the grass so I can get more fat loots. By that I mean more petals and spinach herbs. More important to get those herbs so that I can uh, make more uh, heal potions, heal jars, whatever. Looks so strong. Oh, there's a bear cub.
Thundering Hammer. Damage with a giant hammer can also seal. Okay, let's uh, hit the bear with it. Hurt, I think. Whoa. She just kind of had that in her bag. What? Deals damage equal to 50% of the enemy's current HP. Oh. There. So I can just cut an enemy's health in it. Pretty good. The baby bear sounds so cute. Sulfur, please! Um, can I convert the baby bear with Heartcracker? Yep. Oh, the mother went berserk because of that. I guess that makes sense. Oh, good. The crash didn't do anything. Uh, so I guess we'll just cast a heal on Nikki. And now we'll convert the bear. More bear hugs then. I'm glad that it's way so, um... Consistent, though, as long as you make sure it's the final blow, you get the monster. In, um, but it's limited to just the beast. In Bravely Default 2, converting monsters is like Pokemon, where you have to get their health low to have a better chance. But even at 1 HP, it's not a guarantee. And, uh, kind of blows. Because there are so many times where I... Been, I've tried so hard to get a monster and it just won't get caught, so then I have to murder it. And I really put some of those monsters to work. I'm I'm doing my best to not be so conservative with them that I just, like, never actually use those monsters. Because then I would just be wasting the fact that I'm leveling Beastmaster altogether. And when I fought um, the first boss after getting it... Um... I had gotten a whole bunch of minotaurs from the dungeon leading up to him, and it turned out he was weak to axes, and that's the damage that minotaurs do. And it just, it was like 2,000 damage for every minotaur. It was so nice. I know this is not the way I'm supposed to go, but... Oh, well, more healing jars. That's always good. Oh, great. It's nighttime. So the monsters are going to get more aggressive and dangerous. And this is the wrong way.
So let's go the right way. Well, I hear water. Okay, got some more clear water. Uh, I don't know if this is the farm, but I am just cutting it all down. some water. <whistles> Assignment complete. And now all we have to do is go back and get stamps. Shouldn't we gather some stuff? Gathering uh, yeah, sure. Uh, there are a few types of areas where you can gather ingredient items. Press the X button when you see the... see the displayed icon to gather something. Items you can gather are determined by the icon type. For example, this icon shows you can gather plant type items from the area. As you progress through the game, more types of gathering points will become available. You can gain many necessary items to gather away. Okay, so there's roots and plants. I got a Belgrade potato, carotate, carotato, some dirt, gash twig, spinach herbs. Well, farm, farm areas are pretty rad. Okay, and now we... Wings of Icarus are way back to school. Because walking is for chumps. I'd rather explode. Excuse me, we want to go... We went to go water the plants at the farm. Water the farm? Oh, from Dr. Melanie's class. Please hold on. Vane, Jessica, and Nicole. Yes, I've received records from her that you have indeed watered the plants. What? She was really watching? I wonder where she was. I didn't even notice her. She looks so nice, but she might be a tricky one. Please show me your handbooks for your grades. My A. A. Now I get free time. Obtained required units. Free time! Now I can do character side quests. Yay! We're done with our assignments. Good job, Nikki. We're in free time, and I'm gonna play and play and play all day. Playing's fine, but maybe we should get some jobs. I want to buy some medicine and other stuff, too. Ooh, no way. I don't want to work. Fine, then. What about you, Vane? Do you want to work or play? I think I'm tired, so I just want to rest. Vane, you're like an old man. You're young, you know. Shape up. Get up. S sorry? You now have entered free time. Sure. Free time mostly consists of conversations with your friends. 
Free time is where there is no planned assignments or story progression on the schedule. During this time, there is nothing you must specifically do. During free time, you can go to the guy's dormitory and access your bed and your room to skip immediately to the next planned schedule. That is a waste. Never do it unless you're speedrunning. But there are certain things that you can only get do during this free time, such as character quests, which develop individual character relationships and is also how you build towards one of the uh, several endings. You can check if, the, if a character quest is available by talking to the character. If you get a choice, a character quest will occur. Only one quest can be played through at a time. By playing through these character quests, you will get to understand each character more in depth. Whenever you find free time, it's a good idea to actively look for these quests. You can now go to the guy's dorm and girl's dorm. Let's go ask the student affairs office about jobs and stuff later. We can think about doing it or not afterwards, okay? I guess. Working might be better than being bored. <laughs> I wonder what Nikki usually does. I kinda wonder, or no one cares. What kind of synthesis synthesis does Jess do alone? I wonder, I don't care. I like how those are the options. Yeah, I don't know. Or, yeah, no. I can craft anything over in the weapons area, and then go exploring. Still need the pleather. Or the huffin' in the bag. The uni, I need the black steel for this. Oh, we got another alteration to the female uniform. Um, I think that means I need to unequip it. need pleather cloth. But there's yet another uh, item to synthesize. Jess looks so worried on her character menu. That's kind of weird. I just, I also noticed, um, there's the straw doll, so if I make whatever this is, I will already have the straw doll unlocked. And the ice bomb that's up there will also be unlocked once I figure out whatever this is. Oh, there's another skill, a funny pouch. I want that eluding thorn. I remember Vayne gets some really cool looking skills once you get um, deeper into his uh, pro book. I don't remember... Jess's are mostly really silly. Nikki's are just over the top crazy. Vayne's are just... They're edgy, but they're awesome. Looks like there's a shop here. 
that I haven't accessed, so. Oh, we get a cutscene? Oh, it's Flay. The heck? You're good, as always. Mana of gold? So persistent, give it up already. Or is that cold? I think it's cold. Only a fool would give up when told to do so. What is he- Hey, Flay, you're hurt! Merely a scratch. Oh, so you've got an underling now, huh? Which means we've been at this for a year. Come on, be my mana already. You never learn. The result is so obvious. I think I should stay out of this. I guess Blaze trying hard behind the scene too. So Flay is fighting. Hey, you guys, make sure you guys recycle. <laughs> so Flay is fighting. down earlier because we lost something it's been found it's been home all along aha you're the shop that's out here street vendor Ooh, you sell gloves steel Wigs and puny balls. But gloves, puppy paw gloves. I can now make puppy paw gloves. That's adorable. Might as well see what it takes to make those, and if I can make them, I'm sure that'll unlock something somewhere. I mean, you have to synthesize everything if you want to make your characters as strong as possible, so... Uh, yep, I can make them. And with steel... Ooh. Oh, I can make it a super defensive item. We'll do that. The Gloves of Artorius. Uh, so I need another Necro Cloth. Because of course I do. There we go. Better lighting in the room. But again, this is where my frustrations... This, this was my only complaint in the game as a whole, is having to run back and forth because I need just one more cloth. Or I need... You know, I find a new recipe, and I know I can make all the things, but I have to go around the corner, and it's just... It's not the worst thing in the world, but... Okay, puppy paw gloves. Very soft gloves. It feels so good. Let's 
have these increase days and stun. Okay. That's a good one for Nikki. Is that racist? I'm giving the cat girl puppy dog pause. I'm sure it's fine, right? And that was on her list. So were the gloves. All right. Take the HP, attack, and defense for sure. More HP. And resistance. I'll hold off on the magic right now, because I'm not really using magic. I need black powder for Vayne. But look! Progress! They all needed the gloves of Artorias. Jess is almost out of uh, points. Jess is out of points. I don't even have enough for her to, to max out her skills. Because I've been getting so many of hers. It's ridiculous. But she also doesn't get the killing blows like the other two do. So she doesn't build it up as much. Cap's favorite tiger blowfish. I want to try it too. Can someone catch him for me? I'll be waiting in front of the bulletin board at Student Affairs. Thanks in advance. Took down a memo. It seems the animals of the living forest are up to something. Suppress the gang of uncontrollable animals. Report to the Student Affairs desk. So these don't actually take up time either, so it's best for it... It's generally just good practice to do all the side quests as they're available, then you do your uh, character side quests, and that's how you progress your free time to get the most out of everything. Now, this game does have a new game plus, so, you know, doing everything, missing something isn't the end of the world, but it's still best practice. Especially because then your new game pluses should go faster. As for Tiger Blowfish, I'm really excited now. Um, sure, I'll just see the tutorial. Are just simple load of quests that require you to defeat a target monster or prepare an item. When you complete these jobs, you can get money. Jobs can be accepted from the bulletin board and student affairs starting free time. I like assignments. There is no penalty for not finishing, but they are taken down by the next term. There are two kinds. Fetch, bring an item. Subdue, defeat the bounty monster. Talk to the client for fulfilling requirements to complete the job. You can gain money by doing jobs, and since the bounty monsters will become stronger by grade level, you can take the challenge to test out your skills. I want one where we can just sleep and get like 10,000 coal. <laughs> That's not a real job. Actually, there is one like that. Exactly like it, in fact. What? Really? I want to do it. Let's do it. I was just worried that no one would accept it. It's a request from Dr. Melanie. She wants a patient in deep sleep for a day to test out a few things. An offer from Dr. Melanie? Deep sleep? 
Yes, she would like you to go to the infirmary right now if that's possible. Well, I guess it's not hard-earned if we don't work for it, right? Come on, let's go. We should check the bulletin board. Um... Just for the sake of saving some time... I'm gonna see where you get the tiger blowfish exactly. So I don't run around all over the place looking for... Fish at the Heights. Oh, the same spot. Endless seaweed seems exclusive from fishing on the rock. Tiger blowfish can be gotten from both spots, but different size bar and a little easier from the grass. So, we'll do the Living Forest Combat one first. And I need that the Blowfish for another thing. Oh, I have to go all the way to the Mana Ruins. Well, I can drop by the farm and get some more materials on the way. I'm gonna go all out. also work on getting Jess some of that AP that she needs to increase her... What are the things I need to increase? Attack. I think this will give us leeway. Glacier stones too, which is good because I think the only one I've gotten was one I purchased. So having more of those for crafting would be nice. I forgot how much slowdown this game could could encounter though. Kind of impressive? I don't know. It's. I don't. I think this game is old enough now that slowdown isn't an intolerable thing, but rather impressive for how much they were. They crammed into the game and still managed to get it to run. I think PS2 still is old enough now for that. There's like a, a weird line between when it's it becomes unacceptable for a game to have slowdown. Like if you're playing an old Super Nintendo game, 
and their slowdown, you're just like, oh man, they've, there's so much happening, so many graphics. Oops. What the hell? Where was the warning? Since I didn't hit it, they got to go first. to hit multiple targets? Nope. Can I get a lightning to hit multiple targets? Nope. What about any of the items that I made? Um, I can hit two with the firebomb. Lightning rod only hits one. Let's give it a shot. There. That worked out pretty well. Cost like all my mana just to cast half at once, but you know what? I'll take it. And we get another bear set of bear hugs. I do like that they made it so it's like, oh, you get bear hugs after I just like pulverized it with a hammer. This weird chain hammer thing. It's like now the bear loves you. The skill's even called Heart Cracker. It's like. I don't, I don't get it. They try to be cutesy, but the visual just does not fit. Alright, this is the crossroads. I'm gonna go to the farm. Is there no enemies here? And I can just get loads of skiff. I like skiff. You know, it's funny, because I, I usually give up on crafting-based games. I, you know, Minecraft I find boring. Uh, Terraria was pretty fun for a while, but it did feel like... I mean, I was playing it alone when, like, mostly playing it alone. Uh, so that definitely didn't help. But I, I played up till hard mode started. And then... Uh, kind of just stopped. Um, but uh, in Dragon Quest Builders and this are games that I can play to the end of the story, and I think that's that's the biggest drive for me. I love crafting in theory as long as I've got a little direction and something that's that's pushing me to the end. So, 
you know, there is a narrative in this game. Oh gosh, it's nighttime. The monsters are just going crazy. I even got the first strike, and they're going first. can get a new skill. Uh, attack or defense? Oh, she can get both. Alrighty. Jess is, like, super powered up. I can't get up there. There's the... That's the enemy I've got to kill for this, for the job. So it's actually a swarm, so I have to fight all three of them, all three groups in a row. What the hell? Where was the warning? So many bears. Nah. Not worth. Not yet. Can only do one analyze. Uh, healing echo on Nikki. Yeah, get the healing going. The heart cracker going. Because more bear friends is good. Reinforcements have arrived. Just throw the ice bomb at it. No, I think I want to wait until the next, uh, the next set of enemies. up with a bear. Let's hit the bear with a bear. Right. 
Zane can throw the ice bomb at the tiger. There. One shot it. Oh, she could have ice stormed it. Oh well. I feel like I'm gonna want another healing echo going soon. Heal the wounds. Just be more efficient. Sulfur, please. I do wish I still had the half spell. Hit him with a thundering hammer and see what happens. Do I do that? Or do I just let? Yeah. Silver, but... please. Hit him, let him hit, healing echo goes off, and then we can just defend with everybody else, and get another bear, make up for the one that I used to get him, to hurt him. The boss is here, that wasn't the end. Okay. Sulfur, please. Berserk bear. up with a bear. Stunned him. Heart cracker. Yep, that'll be a crit. Solid damage. All right, I'm ready. What did burst do? I, I think I just get it. Oh, I just get like a massive damage boost. Peace. 20 bear hugs to replace the, what, 16 that I spent? Alright. Um, back to school. Because I did my farming and I did my murdering. Now I have to go back to fishing here. Okay, well, it's not that far in. Everybody still got fully healed because I went back to the school. That's really handy. The slime sat on me. So they get the advantage. It might get kind of hard like this. Ow. 
Ha, you missed. Ow. Slaughtered a few. Ah, oh, so close to killing the harpy. And my game. Man, I am dropping tons of frames tonight. Though. Heal the wounds. Get the heals. Really, just have to hang in there so I can get at least one more heart cracker in there. Is that going to be enough damage? It was one damage short. Well, I gotta minimize the damage, so... until it's Jess's turn and we can get some more panther souls or whatever. Okay. I win. Peace. Harpy's heart and panther pathos. Fishing spot. Ugh. Let's try this anyway. <laughs> Almost one shot. Should have uh, I win. done the heart cracker and to get the the thinger. Let's go ahead and run to the next map real quick just to see. I see treasure and a save point. Oh, 
Interesting. I'm gonna go all out. I wonder what I should make of the fact that there's a save point out here. Save point. Um, it's lightning. Here you go. I don't know if the save point's one is one that will fully heal me or not. Yeah, that's a fat one fully healed. Guess we'll save out here, but that's a pretty nice find. Found a place all the way out in the heights. That'll fully restore your stats. Let's just get back to the fishing spot. We're gonna we're accomplishing like nothing this stream. So I hope you guys are ready for that for more of these kind of streams. Because that is the nature of this game. But when we're not doing story, it's just just a nice chill time. And at least the, the grinding is less just repetitive combat. It's not hope oh, that's not the only thing you do. But once I get more characters, it will be so much more interesting. Beast Fang. Oh, it fails after a certain amount of time, okay. Endless seaweed. I'm getting a- I'm getting an endless supply of seaweed of endless seaweed. And beast fangs. Whoa! That was a wildly fast one. Blowfish. I need more of them, but I found one. And I just remember needing more than one for. I know I need one for crafting something. Tons of joker fish, though.
That's a monster for sure. Masao. I know I needed that for something. Maso. Maso? Maso. I was trying to fail it. But I haven't fought fish before, so... Lantern fish. Okay, they don't have much help. And they're like demons. They're not even beasts, which is kind of odd. We're done. Twelve hours have passed. Maso, Maso. Joker fish? Man, I want the money for the side quest, but if I can't find another one soon, I might just have to call it quits. And keep the uh, blowfish for crafting. It's kind of amazing that I'm catching so many beast fangs. Like, am I, am I ripping them out of a beast's mouth, or are there just a bunch of beast fangs floating down the river? <sighs> One more tiger blowfish, please. was a muscle muscle yep I knew that was a monster I was once again I was trying I'm gonna go all out So. Tiger Blowfish. Awesome. I got I got the two I need. Oh, that's more enemies. Nope. We'll say this is the easiest fishing, and you can tell when it's gonna be an enemy. just nice. Alright, student affairs, turn in the side quests. Got 
Got a thousand dollars. You've completed the request. Good work. I hope to see you again soon. 1,040. For, uh, killing all those bears. Oh yeah, we can go to the girl's dorm. Greedy people are hated, you know? Men should be generous. This is the girls' dorm, no guys allowed. You dirty guys, go away. No. I think there are a few points where you do have to go there. Just why they do that. Why they have it set up that way. Nope. Oh, they mirrored it, so I walked right out. The guys' dormitory, a world only of men. <laughs> I don't know what to make of that comment. If you're going to rest, rest in your own room, but don't rest too much. It's not that good to be greedy. You should share. Yeah, okay. My room and a save point, okay. Funny thing, I don't think I had, in all my time playing this game, before, I don't think I ever once set foot in my bedroom. Alright, what did I need that blowfish for anyway? I caught two of them. He took one? He took both? He took both. That jerk. Okay, that makes me grouchy. seeing if there's any of these anything else that I can make like alternate recipes with possibly I think it's only ever the first ingredient that changes things so I'm pretty sure I needed that fish for something. The masso, masso, masso. Oh, I still need that pleather. I need another... I need to go fishing more. Well, let's just see if the store or the cafeteria has anything new, and then I'll just do one of the other character side quests, and then that'll wrap us up tonight.
here, the cafeteria, check the rumors. The jumpy ones. Jump more than 200 times. Everyone's HP plus 30. Okay, I'll take take health increases for now. Item drop rates are, are nice, but... So do we want Nikki or Jess's story? In truth, I'm feeling Nikki's. Isn't Nikki late? Yeah, maybe she's out playing around again. Speak of the devil. Good morning, Nikki. What's wrong? You seem panicked. Shh, quiet down. Nikki? Let me hide for a bit. Tell them I'm not here, okay? What? Who? Hey. Yeah? You know that girl Nikki's... I know that girl Nikki's here. Uh, well, no. She hasn't come by here yet today. You sure? You better not be hiding her. It's true, but why do you want to see her? I better not see her. You tell her, too. She needs to stop flirting with every guy. What? Nikki does that? She's even- she's e even been making moves on our boyfriends. That cat's a thief. They, I hate beast men. They just don't know their boundaries. That's not nice. Anyway, just make sure you tell her. If she keeps flirting with our boyfriends, we've got a plan for her. We've got an plan for her. Nikki, I think it's safe to come out now. Hey, Nikki, about what they said. Huh? She's not here. Maybe she ran away. I didn't even see her. What should we do? I mean, I think we should at least talk to her about it. Yeah, I think they'll be back soon. You're right. Let's go find her. You know, I realize I think there's actually one other room I haven't been in yet. So I know where she is, because it tells me, but... I think there's a music room down the hall. Oh, the roof. Could have sworn there was a music room, though. What do you want? Don't talk to me. The roof feels so good. Come on, let's go back and finish the synthesis. -s 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 -s. Synthesis -s is just such an awkward thing to say. Are you a freshman? Want to join our workshop? We don't have enough people. So, there's an empty workshop here. Wait, they were going to kick me out, but there's an empty workshop? 
Why would they do that? Because they were trying to get rid of Flay? Someone's workshop. Oh, it's those two. What? You here to recruit Roxas again? Learn when to give up. It's nice to have a new face in our workshop, but he's so unfriendly. Okay, so I found uh, the bullies workshop. Meowy, meowy, mew, meowy, meow. Look, there she is. Oh, phew, you scared me. I thought it was them again. You should be glad it wasn't. What are you doing out here? Yeah, you disappeared on us. We were looking all over for you. Sorry, I couldn't really sit still. Uh, so did they say anything? Uh, something like, stop flirting with people's boyfriends. Is it true, Nikki? Uh, oopsie doops. I try to only go for single guys, but, you know. I don't think that's a good thing either. But, you know... I shall explain the rest for you. But wh where did you come from? That's a minor detail. More importantly, we were talking about Nikki here. Uh, so I'm sure you all understand by now that Nikki is a beast man. Well, she does have pointy ears and a tail. It's not that uncommon. I mean, there's a lot of beastmen people around here. Indeed, they live among us, yet have very different common sense from us. You see, low population causes the view on love to take a different meaning. Population? So you mean you need, um... Exactly! I want to take home a bunch of hubbies and have a bunch of kids. What? uh I don't think you should say that out loud. Why not? You know... Vain, you see, there are many ideals as as many ideals as there are individuals. Do not think of your own ideal as the only ideal. Well, I guess you're right, but Wow, you seem to know Nikki pretty well. Oh yeah, I don't remember telling you though. I'm always acquainted with my subordinates' profiles. Anyway, I'm off! Good day! And off he goes! He's a busy man. Yeah. I almost forgot, the girls were saying, I get it now, it's okay. I don't want to pick the meat off others' bones. I guess it's fine. I'll just have to find... I'll just have to go find another guy. See ya! I wonder if she really understands. Who knows? That was shorter than I thought. I guess we can do Jess's as well. Because you don't have to worry about the... Um, it's only the last of their story quests that you have to worry about. Alright, what kind of synthesis does Jess do alone? Good morning, huh? No one's here yet. Everyone's so lazy. There is a synthesis I've always wanted to try. Since no one's watching, I wouldn't suggest it. It's gonna explode again, you know. Nuh-uh! Come on, help me. I'll have no part in whatever happens, though. Oh dear.
Uh oh, I'm late. I should hurry. An explosion? It sounded like it came from our workshop. <coughs> See? I told you so. That's strange. I didn't even use anything that could explode. Because you made it explode. That's your gift. What happened? Oh, that's a lot of smoke. Jess, are you okay? Um, I think I just kind of messed up a little. A little? So what are you going to do about this? If they find out, I'll get in trouble. This calls for... What? Destruction of evidence! What? We'll toss the trash, replace the tools, and... Can you help me? I, I guess. Thanks! Let's put this all away. Maybe she's more carefree than I thought. She's just used to explosions. She explodes things that often, huh? Oh, I needed to do something in the hallway. I know the thing I have to do at the campus grounds, but... What do I have to do in the hallway? Is she on the roof? Or is it she putting it in the empty room? specifically said I needed to do something in the hallway. But I don't see Jess. Do I just need to do the campus grounds one first then? Yep, there it is. And now the evidence is all gone. Yeah, no one saw us, right? I saw that. Ah! Just kidding. Did I scare you? Oh, it's you. Please, don't scare me. I mean, you guys were so scared. Anyway, I suggest you guys go back soon. I'll remember this. Now we need new tools. Maybe there's some extras in another workshop. Okay, that's why. So we blew up... <sighs> she blew up our tools and we're just gonna go steal some. Works for me, I guess. Or are we actually gonna steal them from... We're gonna steal them from the bully people. Oh, that's even better. from someone's workshop.
Hello? Excuse me. There's no one here. What should we do? This is our chance. Huh? Jess, what are you? Shh, just stand watch so that nobody sees us. Okay. This and this. Ooh, I've always wanted one of these. And Jess. Oh, oops. I just. Sorry. I'll just take what we need. I mean, isn't that still bad? Okay, now we have to escape before anyone comes. Let's go. Go, go, run away! Isn't this wrong? It's fine. Nobody likes them. And we're done. Yeah, I think this should be fine. Thank you very much for helping me, Vane. No problem, but I heard your mana earlier. You fail often? No, that's not true. Today was an accident. She fails about... Does 4 out of 10 times sound about right? Shush, don't say that. That often? No, it's just when I try something difficult, I fail often. She's like a reverse Hermione. Oh. Hey, you don't believe me, do you? Sorry I'm late. Does it smell kind of burnt in here? I think it's just your imagination. Yeah, that's it. It's just your imagination. Okay, whatever then. That was a close one. Uh-huh. If it happens again, I'll be counting on you, okay? You're planning to mess up again? No, that's not what I meant, you meanie. Event! We'll get to the next save point and then we will be done for the night. Now I'm sure that all of you are excited, so I'll announce your final exam. <laughs> Lie it down now. The topic of this exam is, how quickly can you make a specific item? And now, receive the re recipe for strong fiber. Dietary fiber can now be made. Go make a dietary fiber. It's due tomorrow afternoon. <laughs> What? Tomorrow? That's impossible. I'm so delighted to see you all so happy. Well, that's it. You're free to go. Good luck. Man, that's a great way of just... Final exam. Here's a thing you don't know anything about. Do tomorrow. Tomorrow afternoon? Oh no! What should we do? I'm gonna go up to the library to look it up. Then go back to the workshop. Got it. But it's my final exam already for freshman year. I think you... The game really is just school stuff with uh, inklings of, of your proper story sprinkled throughout. Um but you don't really start getting into the real the real story, I think, until like junior or even senior year. Sorry to keep you waiting. There you are. Doesn't seem too hard. If we have the materials, we can make it right now. What do we need? Well, it says we need spinacher, burdock straight, and clear water. That's easy, and I was worried for nothing. But if you use a Huffin instead of the Spinacher, it's much higher quality. Huffin? Yep, there's this one tree in the heights where we can get it. But we don't have much time. I don't think we need to go that far. Fools! What? Out of nowhere again. Using what's at hand? Outrageous! An alchemist always aims for the best. I know what you're saying, but... 
Weaklings, I forbid you to use the cauldron until you bring me a huffin. But that's not fair. I want to make other stuff, too. If you want to use it, hurry up and get the huffin. This is crazy. So you can get that huffin, I won't let you lay a finger. Well, that's irritating. Alright, but that's still a good place to stop. And I need a huffin' anyway, so I'm not really that beat up about it. I already have potions. So I have everything I'll need for next time. Alright, so that concludes us for tonight. Um, so Tuesday we begin on Subnautica Below Zero. I am simultaneously excited and terrified of what's going to happen. I have looked up nothing about the game, I have only heard very minimal stuff, I have kept myself away from anything. When I played the first Subnautica, I went out and I looked up all the big monsters, I looked up the Reaper Leviathans, where you could find them, all that jazz, so I wouldn't be as terrified. This time, we're gonna go as blind as possible. We'll see how that goes. But we're planning to make that the Tuesday-Thursday stream for a while, see what happens. Wednesday, we're gonna do Sakuna of Rice and Ruin on the Switch. Um, and continue with Manakamiya on Sundays. Um, I am probably gonna be doing some other cool stuff. Some other, I do need to work on some other ideas that we have going on. Um, in a couple, uh, I just f uh, finished the Monster Hunter board game Pledge Manager today. Um, so... Yeah. <clears throat> so that means that we'll have, um... So the, the Monster Hunter board game, whenever that comes in, we will definitely do a whole learn to play, read the rules, whatever. I'll, I'll figure out exactly how we're going to do it. It has single player, so I can at least do that much and, and go through how the game works and show off all the minis. Um, and I'm getting some more Malifaux minis soon because I have got a coupon that's about to expire, so I've got to get, got to get something from them. They just won't put the miniature I want on there because weird is always slow. Anyway, so we've got a lot of things planning coming going forward. Um, I think that's everything for now. So, uh. Thank you guys for watching. Have yourselves a great night. Stick around while we find somebody to crusade against for... Yeah. I don't know the right way of putting that yet. I still... I like crusade more than raid for our theming, but... I mean, raid is shorter and everybody knows what I mean. Alright. Anyway. Jeez. Have a good night.